Okay, here's a small video just to show the um, KX3. Just put the volume down. The KX3 and the KPA500 linear amplifier. Uh, KX3 is um, plugged in, you can see there, on the auxiliary 2 port here and uh, to the PTT input of the KPA500 and uh, just using here a patch lead into the input of the amplifier. Uh, I'm on 10 meters at the moment and uh, I'll just set the power uh, down to, let, let's see how far down it will go, let's go down to uh, 5 watts. Okay so there's 5 watts, let's see what the amplifier will do with that. Okay showing a hundred between 100 and 150 watts out into a, a 1 to 1 SWR antenna. Um, so let's try um, reducing it even further. Let's try 1 watt, see if that will actually key the... There's 1 watt there, let's try that. Yeah, nothing happening on the... It's keying the amplifier, you can see the star coming up beside the frequency readout, but no actual power output. So let's try two watts. Yeah, there's uh there's the first LED on, which I suppose is between zero and twenty-five watts out. So let's go up to three watts. Three watts gives fifty watts out. Four watts. Seventy-five watts out, roughly. And um, let's just whack that up to 5 watts. Yeah, 5 watts is giving 125 watts out. 6 watts, 150 watts out. 7 watts, 175 watts out. 8 watts, 175 still. 9 watts, 200 watts out. 10 watts, 225 watts out, 11 watts, 275 watts out, and 12 watts, 275 watts still. So there you go, the, KP, uh, the KX3 into the KPA500 linear amplifier. 12 watts maximum out of the KX3 into the linear amplifier and 275 watts out. Okay, thanks for watching.